Hey everybody, Rick Needham handicapping thoroughbred racing from the Del Mar Thoroughbred Club. On Sunday afternoon, July the 24th, and this is my Equibase Winter Circle Southern California Racing Report. Let's take a look at one of two stake races on the card this afternoon, folks. Uh, race 6, 4.30 p.m. Pacific Post Time, the California Dream and Handicap. Eight and a half furlongs on the turf, three year olds, and up racing for $100,000. Contenders number one, Norvisky. Number seven, Lucky Primo. Number two, Tamarack Smarty. And number eight, Adilus Jack. Number one, Norvisky has produced power run performances in each of his last five outings, hitting the board in four of those adventures. Number seven, Lucky Primo has hit the board in each of his last five outings, winning twice, including a power run win his last time out. Jockey Tyler Bays was in his irons for that last win 30 days ago at Hollywood Park, which produced a positive 850% return on investment in the process. Bays is back today for his second ride gunning for back-to-back -back circle trips. Race 6 summary number 1, Norvesky tops my contenders list, which also includes number 7, Lucky Primo, number 8, Tamarack Smarty, and number 8, Adelis Jack 1728 in the six from Del Mar, the $100,000 California Dreamin' handicap. Bonus long shots, Woodbine, race five, number six, tomorrow came nine to two in the morning line. Speed leader in this maiden field, sprinting at her about eight and a half for ones on the dirt. Canterbury Park, race seven, here in the $50,000 Dean Cut Stakes. The speed honors shared by the 9 to 2 shot, number three, Ambassador of War, and an 8 to 1 shot, number six, Rafi. So from Del Mar on a Sunday, Rick Nita for the Equibase Winter Circle, reminding you as always to please bet with your head, not over it.